Hey y'all, thank you for tuning in. This channel isn't for everyone. I'm Christian, I'm black. I have vitiligo. <laughs> I'm a business owner. I'm a content creator. I'm in my 20s. I'm a normal person. I have a bunch of different hats. I cannot conform to just one type of content. But if any of this is relatable, feel free to stick around. Welcome to the Evelyn Chanel's world. There's room for you. Good morning, beautiful faces. It is the start of a new vlog. Your girl is back at you with another video. Um, and so, yeah. Tomorrow is actually the first weekly vlog day that I'll be posting. That ain't come out right. But y'all get what I'm saying. Tomorrow is the first day I actually post. The tomorrow is the first day I post. Tomorrow is the day I post my first weekly vlog. Because you slow. <laughs> you slow. But, um, so I'm up now. It's Sunday. My mom didn't tell me she was going to church. I still have the baby. From the end of last vlog, I still got the baby. So I'm about to go up here. I had to go get him something to eat. Uh, he actually ended up falling back to sleep. Uh, and I was about to get him a... Well, I was going to get him a bath get him dressed and then we're gonna go get something to eat and i was gonna go feed my dog but he fell asleep so i was like well let me just run around the corner go get him something to eat come back feed him you know put on his clothes or whatever like that and then we can ride out we can go wherever but we can't really i don't have anything to do today that causes me to get out the house i do i'm lying today is wash day but i have to go get my dog my dog needs a bath <laughs> And I have to finish someone's hair. So, I'll be doing a uh, hot oil treatment again today. Hot oil treatment. Or just an oil treatment. Which you can call it oil treatment. Well, it's hot because my hair be hot. But, I got to do an oil treatment. And I have to do um, a... Is it a hair mask or is it a deep condition? One of those. We're going to see these products. But, no, we won't. Uh, it's a simple video. It's a simple video. It's a simple video. But you guys will be getting the behind the scenes of me doing that today. Uh, and I said I wasn't going to do another wash day for my hair series. But I think because, it's at least for the first couple of months, I think because I only shampoo my hair once a month, it's okay. It's okay. I think it's okay. If it's not okay, it's going to be okay. It's going to be a monthly update is what it's going to be. But it's watch that with me. And we're going to incorporate some new each time. Try some stuff. And I know y'all probably tired of me using TikTok, but it's okay because I'm not recording from my phone until I upload my first video today. I could upload my first video today. And it will hopefully I can record from my phone with my whatchamacallit, as long as I upload my first video today, get all that footage on my phone, then we'll be fine. But I gotta upload this first video before I switch over to that. So I have already um, deleted the videos thus far that I have. I'm pretty much done with this video, so I'm gonna go ahead and, once I download it to my computer, I mean my phone, then everything is fine. As long as I can download it to my phone, then we're good. So, yeah. By the time I get done, or get ready to get into the hair video it'll be back you know the other way but as for the vlog baby you're gonna be looking at me like this until i, I upload next week's video <laughs> periods which will be in the next couple of days so i'm working on you guys i told y'all i was gonna delete it for y'all and i'm doing it so bear with me Okay, so I got the oil on my head, but I'm really about to pull it off. I think it's been sitting on here for at least 30 minutes, so I just run my mouth a lot. But I'm going to try to hold out just a little, long, little while longer. And the baby went back to sleep on me, y'all. So I was going to hop in the shower while he was asleep. But then I realized I had to wash my hair while I get in the shower. And I'm just going to really walk around with my conditioner on my head. So what I'm about to do is do some grooming. Because your girl is hairy. Hairy. It's 
scary here. What I'm gonna do is, and I'm gonna wake him up and put him in the sub because I really think it's about time for him to get in the sub. We'll get back up and like. Stage, period. As you can see, I'm in the car. It is 447. I forgot that I was supposed to be on the Zoom call at 5 o'clock. Ooh, eyebrows giving fresh. Period. And they ain't looking like Bush would be on all. I'm a lot less hairy than I was when we first started to vlog. What you talking about? Yeah. Oh, I don't know what my right about that. But yeah, I'm just not leaving the house. I'm finna go drop them all. Then I'm going to my mom's house to feed my dog. Um, and I'm gonna jump on the zoom in between time. Um, oh, I'm never on time. Try to be going with the flow. I really forgot. Honestly, truthfully. It's 11 17 and I'm just making it home. Put door hair. Didn't finish. She has micro locks though, so I mean it's she's very understandable as well. So but I'm about to get in the shower. I've had this deep condition sitting on my head since one something. So yeah, it's been on there for quite some time. But I ain't tripping y'all. So I'm about to get in the shower. Before I get the rim, I'm about to get in the shower and then I'll, bring, I'll be back. Good morning, beautiful faces. It is Monday and it is 10 51 and I need to start scratching my face. <clears throat> so we finally, finally, finally got today's video to download so that I could upload it. So that's what we're about to do now. Um, And then I'm going to work on the next couple. Well, no, after that, we're going to get that done. It's, First on the marker. Then next we are going to work on making a list of things that I have to do for today. But I'm going to do that after I get to my mom's house. And then we're going to go ahead and proceed with the week. But, um, of course, I got to upload this video. Do all the little behind the scenes, the, you know, little work or whatever. Um, the thumbnail, the um, tag, the title, all of that. So that's what I'm about to do now. And I'm not going to be able to do a screen recorder right now because we press it for memory. So the video is uploading right now. But of course, the Wi-Fi sucks here. The service sucks here. And everything is loading slowly, which is pissing me off. But I have moved on to my next task because I have made my to-do list right. And my next ta task is to secure... Um, it's a security check for Square, uh, where my website is. So if you guys were concerned with, you know, using my website because you thought it wasn't secure, baby, just know I got to upload my government. I Hold on, I'll show you. Like, seriously, I'm not. 
So, yeah, I'm probably going to speed that up because I don't want to put nobody information on here. But just know they are asking me for proof of this. Uh, so, it covers my client's tail as well as my tail. Because at this point, I'm irritated. I was already irritated, but now, because what is this? Why is this Josh should handle this? This is something that Josh should be going through when the payment is given. They're not ready. I, like, my customers have to sign contracts to even work with me. I'm not understanding. What's the issue? But, okay, I'm glad that you guys are taking safety precautions. So, this is to my customers that are watching my videos. Here you go. Proof. Good morning. What am I saying? Good morning. Good morning. Lovelies. Um, I'm actually on the way to pick up my mom's um, my other grandma, um, and take her to her doctor's appointment. I'm actually running behind. She got to be there at 9.15, and it's, uh, like right before 9 o'clock. It's like middle of 8, 57, something like that. I want to go get a tea or some coffee or something, but I don't run out of time, which is probably good because I don't need to be spending no money no way. Um. But as you can see, I did not put my hair down loose just yet because I slapped this hat on here. But I pulled the, uh, what you call it, out my head. The pine rise out my head. And then it's raining and stuff. So, yeah. But yeah, so I'm her. I'm her. I am alive and well. But the video, it just don't want to upload. Oh, like I said, later we're going to talk about, like, new greeting. Not the new intro because I'm not, I like my intro right now. I'm pretty sure it'll probably be irritating for people to watch my videos over and over again because just you know you just get used to hearing the person's video that you watch you get used to hearing their intro so I mean, not irritating but you know it may get like a little old or something like that to y'all but new people that's coming in I feel like you know when they first see it they're gonna be like oh that's cute you know it's give what it's supposed to be gay so I'm not changing my intro I like it but <laughs> I want to come up with like a new intro greeting for you guys. And it's going to, I don't know, it's going to correlate to my intro. It's going to be like, you know. I just, I told you I didn't want to do hey y'all no more. Because I feel like everybody was doing hey y'all. But I want to do something, you know. Grab your seat. You know, something to do with, you know, it says at the end of it. It, say, it says, welcome to the Evan Chanel's world. There's room for you. You know, it's Nelly Gang or no gang, period. But for hashtag purposes, we're going to be like Nelly Tribe because I don't want nobody trying to strike my channel because I just said the word gang or nothing like that. So I'm still doing research on that. But I hear other people say gang, so it better be because I like Nelly Gang or no gang. It's the Nelly Tribe. We locked in. Period. Something like that. You know, something cute. Something cute. Grab your seat. It's the Nelly Tribe. We locked in. It's Nelly Gang or no gang. Period. Nelly Gang in his thing. Something, you know, something cute, something catchy, something vibey, you know. Even a little cringy, if you will. But it's something, very much something. Always something for you guys to work with. Something. I'm gonna give you, I'm giving y'all something. I'm giving y'all. I'm gonna get y'all so, like for real. Like so, yes. You look I can't do no poll. Because if I do it to my Instagram, I mean, if I do it to my Instagram, it'll go on my Instagram. And maybe I just ask my, I'm going to ask, I'm going to ask my social medias. I'm going to ask my, what I'm, what I'm asking them. Girl, no, I'm going to figure it out and I'm going to figure it out and I'm going to post it. That's what I'm going to do. And that's just going to be what we go with. But why? Because this is my channel. I'm tired of, you know, we not going to be asking other people for their opinions. We not going to be asking other people for their opinions. Not to say that I don't, you know, appreciate y'all opinions, but it's not enough of y'all. Y'all not active enough. Y'all not coming enough to for me to take y'all opinion. That's what it's giving. That's what it's giving. So you know. Okay, sorry. I'm, I'm, I had to do a little rant. But yeah, so you know what that means. Y'all need to be more interactive if y'all want to say something. What's going on? And today it's gonna be Chanel is making the calls by herself because Chanel is having to build this channel from the ground up and I'm I'm thankful for the one you know that's is watching but I need y'all to oh get out the road baby pick him up I need y'all to come in a little bit more or something but I gotta go pick my grandma up so I'm gonna come back y'all and I got 
ten, five minutes to get to where I'm going, which I can do because I got here in five minutes. So. Period. <laughs> Y'all, I done rushed to get here. They ain't even got my granny ready. Child, my grandma laid up on the couch chilling. Child, I done rushed. Y'all, y'all see, I'm about to smash my little curls. And baby, child, at this point, now I got to call my mama because what am I supposed to do, child? I need somebody to go with me to my doctor's appointments. You want me to tell somebody? Child, they ain't finna cancel this because she late. Child, what? My grandma ain't even ate yet. Like, if I was supposed to be here at 7 o'clock, which my mom told me, you know, you need to get over there and get her dressed. I'm thinking she gonna be ready when I get here. Like, ra ta ta ta. I'm in the ghetto. I'll be back. I'll be back. More of the story is we ended up being too late and I had to reschedule the appointment. And I'm pissy. And I'm very pissy. But I'll talk to y'all later. Ghetto. The ghetto. <laughs> so I get to my grandma's house. My grandma is not dressed and she has not eaten. I got to my grandma's house already pushing it. Apparently the appointment was at 920. So I would have made it down time because I know me. Ain't nobody tell me that I needed to get there and make sure that she was dressed though. So the story goes, she has two caretakers. One that stays pretty close and the other one comes right. Um, the one that stays pretty close was supposed to get her up this morning and make sure that she had eaten and she was ready for her appointment according to the other caretaker, my sister, I believe, and my uncle. That didn't happen. I got there. My grandma was still in her pajamas. So the caretaker that is there gets her dressed. My uncle finishes up her breakfast and she eats. By that time, it's, it's 9 30, 9 20. So I just proceed to go ahead and go to the doctor's office and reschedule the appointment myself. So I reschedule it for Thursday. We're going to try this again Thursday. At this point, if I was supposed to be there at 6 o'clock this morning to make sure she was ready by sale, then just say that. You would think that this side of my family would be heads all together. No. And I'm just sitting here having a conversation with God because this is ghetto. The other my other side of the family, the media part anyway, is just me, my dad and my grandma. Like literally my grandma has no other kids except for my dad, so it's just me, her and my dad. On this side, my grandparents has five other children. And then my granddaddy got a couple of other children apart from my grandma. Child, you would think Cause they, let me tell you something. Let me. I'm gonna I'm let y'all in on a little something. And somebody gonna be mad at me if they watch this, but I don't even care. But they, you would think that they have it prim and proper and very much together. On the other side of the family, it's my grandma. Like I said, my daddy. My grandma is close with her siblings. She's very close, so it's all pretty much close knit and together like that. On this side of the family, it on my mama's side of the family, it's my mama, her siblings, my grandma. We skipped that whole level on my daddy's side. So you gonna say it's 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 better you know it's smaller you don't have to deal with a whole bunch of personalities i love my grandma to, like I, my daddy mama i love her to the death of me i love every i love her with every being in my body like i love my grandma everything about my grandma i'm for it like my grandma is the apple of my eye literally on the other side of the family, I've done a story time about my grandma on this side. Oh, not, it's not story time. It's part of my healing process. I've done a healing process about my grandma on this side of the family. My granddad is dead. Both of my grand grandfathers are gone. They gone. And the older I get, now I'm starting to see why they gone. Because had they been here, it would have been a whole different other story. And it probably would have turned out for me being very spoiled. Like they call, they like to call me a brat now, but if my if my grandfather was still here, being that it's only me, my daddy, and my grandma, I would be very much he would be wrapped around my finger. And I think I think God really knew that. And I think that's the reason my life that turned out the way it did. And it's very much give it ghetto. And I'm a little pissed right now. And had my other grandfather still been here, he would have been hundred years old. But my family would not be acting the way that they be acting. The ghetto! The ghetto! The ghetto! And you know what? I'm not, I, I'm mad. I'm pissed. I am pissed because I miss my granddaddy. My granddaddy was my very much my protector. My, the apple of my eye. Just like the same way my grandma is. I, my, my dad said I didn't get to know him like that because.
because he died when I was one and a half. Heard me say, and I would have had him wrapped around my finger, and God knew that. My granddad on the other side, he knew that he had to, he had to retrieve his soldier because he had to un unveil some things on this side of the family. It's giving very much, you guys are ugly, and I'm sick of it. Not even ugly physically or anything like that, but like, y'all got some stuff that y'all need to work on. And it's a bunch of them. That's the difference. Like, not to say that my, my father is perfect. Not to say my mama is perfect because neither my, one of my I ain't perfect. I'm not perfect. But, God, <laughs> I, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Get out. Why would you have done this to me? Y'all, I, oh, I haven't really did a sat down, sit out, and tell y'all what happened. Right. But it's okay because I'm gonna have a conversation with y'all. Now, part of it I can't share with y'all because that's coming in the latest series. Like, is that that particular Saturday? Saturday was literally um, the key to unlocking one my next level in Christ into. Let me calm down. One my next level in Christ into a lot of the blessings that God has for me and the gifts that He wants to give me. I'm gonna have to implement a lot of stuff um, so that we can keep it cute over here. But. We talk about that later. I do a sit down portion, like I said, in this video or whatever like that, because we're going to keep it rolling. <laughs> but one of the things that I was, one of the things that was revealed to me, which I had already known, but it was like, just like confirmation during that process was that I was going to have to be the one to bring a lot of healing to my family. Because why? Y'all, I ooh, I could, I could cut up, I could cut up, I could cut up. And I know y'all probably like, well, Chanel, it's just she just missed one appointment. She, no, it's levels to this. It is levels to this. It is more than just with me smut. Don't cuss. It is more than just what meets the eye. This just really set a fire up under me. This because it's giving very much. Stop depending on other people. It's five of y'all. All of y'all is here and alive. It is five of y'all. These are my grandmothers and my grandfather's children together. It's five of y'all. Not to mention the ones that want to have a relationship with y'all outside that he had on his own before my grandma. The ones that want to have a relationship with y'all and that are willing to. You know what I'm saying? Extend that hand to help. I say that it's five of y'all. It is five of y'all. I don't care if all y'all ain't here. Y'all should be able to figure this out. Some type of way. But now y'all want to go live y'all lives with y'all understand. You don't want to put your life on hold because of nobody else. But it's five of y'all. Figure it out. Figure it out. And let me tell y'all what really pisses me off. Because there should be no reason why my mama or two, my auntie are the only two people that's pulling the weight like this. It is four weeks in a month. In a couple of days. Y'all can take times out of y'all busy schedules to come home. Y'all don't want to. But y'all want to cry and talk about how y'all don't want her to go nowhere. And y'all sick of sad and all this other stuff. Figure it out. 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 But not even that alone. So let's go. Well, Chanel, you can do some of that too because you're here. You're right. I'm here. I'm here right now. You're right. And I'm going to do my due diligence. I'm going to do my part. I'm going to do my part to help my mama because my mama needs it. So you're right. I'm going to do what I got to do. But like I said, this is y'all mama. And it's five of y'all. Y'all should be able to figure something out to where stuff like this shouldn't happen. It shouldn't be where I was supposed to get her dress. No, it's five of y'all. Figure it out. So I forgot to come back and check in. I done did a lot of stuff since then. Like I told you, my grandma's appointment, well, I pretty much, I'm not even going to go through all that. But you see what the hair looking like. But after I came to the house and realized that the door was locked, I had left and went to go see my spiritual advisor, sister. Mm, yeah.
she's both very much so <coughs> oh cover your mouth but yes yeah, so i ended up standing up there all, all day um like literally it was like from 11 to she got up at five and i got up. i left when she left when she got off i sat up there and then i came to my mom's house where i am and i've been sitting in front of my computer ever since just figuring stuff out i actually have to kind of when I, it's not an itinerary it's like a what do you call it? a confirmation reservation confirmation documentation so that I will have it from now on so I'm just gonna, like I said I'm just gonna make a template template and I actually have to fill it out and send it to a couple of my customers um I think I've already mentioned this but I'm planning a uh, vacation for Jamaica I actually be going on a vacation myself but it's a group vacation I mean, so, yeah, I had to do a lot of transitioning and stuff, but where there's a will, there's a way, and God always provides. I'm pretty much doing everything myself, which is okay. I like it. I'm cool with it. Why? Because I get to put my own logo on there and my own sayings and stuff like that. What I'm actually about to do is now that I'm sitting here thinking about it, I'm about to, uh, I'm going to do the little template, but then I'm going to make sure that I edit it from my, my iPad because on my iPad I can put my little emojis and stuff. If you do not know, my emojis for my travel company is the uh, white and blue airplane with the um, the double heart, the pink hearts, and it's like a heart right here. I put it on the screen so you can see it. That is like my emoji logo or like my emo my signature emoji for my uh, travel agency, and I want to put that on there as well as my signature. And I actually need to create a personal email or not a personal but a separate email for travelers because right now travelers doesn't have his own email but to keep everything separate and organized i need to create one for that and i need to put my actual actual signature on my email address as well as my business email address because i am running both of those myself right now i'm running all my emails myself right now so period with that being said I probably won't show y'all how to do it specifically in this video, but um, I will show y'all the finished products once I get done. Good morning. I am creating my list of things that I need to get done today. Okay, so I started off with one, you know, this week or whatever like that, but of course, as the week goes on, other tasks are added to your list of things that you need to get done, and so that is very much what I'm doing now. Uh, So right now, on the list, on the top of the list, I have contact Santa May, which I'm about to do right now, and then I have to send off a vacation email to one of my customers. I worked with her a couple of times, mm. So she's a, you know, consistent customer. She's going to have, you know, some type of special something coming real soon. Once I get everything together, then I have to finish options for another vacation um, that's getting ready to be planned for a anniversary. I need to follow up on, with another customer about um, seeing if they were ready to go ahead and begin booking their reservations for the Jamaica trip. I need to add a link to the weekly vlog that I just posted yesterday uh I need to finish uh a family oh I keep saying uh get it out get it out say it say it stop saying uh say what it is I need to finish the family group chat for my mom's side of the family it's not a family group it's a Facebook group that I need to finish I need to call the grill to reserve a dinner room for my grandma's birthday, which is at the end of this month. It's March, very much so. I need to make an event list so that I can start, you know, putting this stuff in my calendar and making sure that I'm up to up to par. Ooh, not you stuttering. Then I need to start working on my next video that needs to go up, which is a hair video. I need to write down my vacation so that I can set reminders for my email to put it into vacation mode. Then, of course, as uh, I finish these tasks, there are other tasks that I need to add, but I can't do some of those tasks until I do this. For instance, I need to call the grill first um, to reserve a spot, and then after that, I'll make, like, advice for my grandmother's birthday dinner. And, you know, then I'll need to send those out, so i make a remind, you know, I'll make a little tab for to do that. Um, it was something else that I needed to do uh, with my event. Stop saying, uh, with my event list. 
I also need to, that's what I need to do. I need to make a list of videos. Like, I need to make a video schedule, basically. A video and a TikTok schedule. And I need to actually stick to it this time. And that includes editing, recording, and posting. I need to record certain videos by a certain day, edit videos by a certain day, and then have them uploaded by a certain day. Because we're gonna have we're gonna be decent in the order around here. We ain't gonna have step. Y'all like I'm so serious. It's how I know I didn't said it before, but child, we got to get a move on. We got to be successful. We gotta be great. And I don't have any negative energy around me anymore. And I'm just really excited because negative energy, whether you know it, whether you believe it or not, it will drain you. People be around you with energy that you be thinking be pure and genuine when in reality, that's probably the reason why you're not getting what you're supposed to get because of that negative soul sucking energy that's around you. So cleanse your energy, cleanse the people that you got around you and do what you got to do. Pray about it and ask the Lord to reveal. And that's your song, Periodica. Speaking of which, I need to give a PSA. So let's talk about it. So by now, it may or may not be included in videos. Probably not, but that's okay because my videos are two weeks ahead right now. My vlogs, my weekly vlogs are two weeks ahead, if I'm not mistaken. So this is, I just put, well, actually, it's kind of like two, three, something like that. So I just posted my first weekly vlog yesterday and this weekly vlog is of course the fourth weekly vlog which i'm sure you can tell by the title so if i haven't by now then i'm going to show you guys something really quickly so we're going to just talk about this little picture where you see this right here so from now on because i know everyone isn't christian but i am i'm y'all know what i am i talk about it in my intro from now on, when I'm about to take a deep dive or give like a, um, what you call it, like a little sick to, like if I'm in the video weekly vlog, right, and I start talking about Christianity, Christ, you know, uh, believer mentality, that type of stuff, I'm going to flash this across the screen. Why? Um, because everyone doesn't want to hear about that. And so I'm giving you guys a chance to you know, speed up the video if need be so that you don't have to hear about that if that's not something that interests you. Um, because I know with this, like with weekly vlog specifically, I'm doing a whole bunch of stuff. Everyone is not interested in that particular thing in my life. I'm starting out with that one. I'm starting off with that one, but eventually it'll be other little flashes that come across too. So like if I'm talking about business stuff, that'll come across because everybody's not interested in um hearing about that. Um, if I'm, you know, just different little stuff that I do, different little hats that I wear, I'll flash it across the screen so that you know that you can go ahead. Well, that's not something that I'm interested in, so I'm gonna go ahead and fast forward, you know, specifically. And I'm starting off with, of course, the believers one because I don't want nobody feeling like I'm forcing, I'm forcing Christianity on them. One thing that I will say, and I will not apologize for, is me being, like I said, a believer in Christ. I believe the Father, I believe in the Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, all in one, all that good stuff. And that's just who I am. But I don't want anyone to ever feel like I'm forcing that on them. So I'm giving you a chance to be warned. You will never say that I forced anything on you. You will never say that you didn't know it was coming up. You will never say that I'm crossing over boundaries or nothing like that. I mean, even though. If you're watching here, if you hear, you should know that. But you'll never say that DM and Chanel forced it on you because I gave you a very much warning. Will I uh, send myself down? No, everything. Like I said, I am what I am. But I'm giving you a warning when I specifically am talking about those type of issue or that topic. I will flash something that's across the screen so you can fast forward. So yeah, Periodica, I will never um tone down who I am, but what I can do is I can give you common courtesy to warn you. I will do that. I will do that. I have no problem with doing that. Mm. But I am Christian. I am Christian. I do believe in God. I love the Lord with all my heart. Even though I don't act like it all the time. But you get what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying. You get it, you get it. So period. That's what we are working on. I do have a lot of stuff in the works for 
the Evelyn Chanel in general. She has a lot going on. She has a lot that she's planning. She has that. That fire has been sparked under her. I have stuff that's already been pre-recorded and it's just waiting on organization and stuff like that. And so we going to be, today is going to be an organization type of day. Today is going to be a, um, you know, a business type of day. It's what is Wednesdays. Wednesdays Wednesday are usually for travel looks, I believe, but travel looks has been taking their heart right now. Travel looks is just going with the flow right now. Um, the only reason the what vacation with the evolution there isn't going with the flow right now because I have people that are reaching out to me that want to plan vacations. The Lord is good. Let's start there. God is good all the time, all the time. God is good because. I really, like I told y'all, I had, to, my businesses had come to a halt. Like, seriously, I'm so serious. Even before I told y'all that, even before I recorded that video, because I just told y'all that yesterday. Y'all just saw it in that clip yesterday. But even before I recorded that clip, because that clip, that week was record, recorded during Valentine's Day week. That was almost a month ago. Before I had even mentioned it, said it out loud, spoken to the universe, I had already slowed down on my businesses anyway. But guys... God said, no, you're going to continue to do that. You're going to continue to, um, you know, run your business. So right now I'm allowing my businesses to go with the flow. People have been reaching out to me. People have been wanting to plan vacations. And I have been taking those plans and planning those vacations. When people get ready to buy from Travel Lux, people get ready to buy from Travel Lux, and I will put those orders in. And you get them to say, order that stuff and customize it and send it to my customers. And that's just going to be that. That's how I am doing life with my businesses now but i am an entrepreneur i do have two businesses i am C I am a ceo and an entrepreneur period point and blank i am the evelyn chanel but the evelyn chanel has other callings as well she has other things that she has to do as well so it's not just youtube it's not just TikTok, it's not just travel looks, it's not just vacation with the evelyn chanel there's other things that are behind the scenes that i have to do um, and I say all that to say, besides the content that I have purposely planned specifically for this platform, God has allowed me to have this platform, whether big or small, to document all of the things that I'm about to get ready to accomplish and take part in. And I thank God for that. Luckily for y'all, you guys get to see that process because I'm going to record that. And some of this stuff, of course, is recorded for my specific purposes, especially right now because my YouTube is smaller. But I'm pretty sure as I grow, you know, the following, the family, the support will grow. Nelly Tribe will go because this is Nelly Tribe. That's the vibe, period. So welcome to Nelly Tribe if I haven't told you guys already. Like I told you, I'm getting ready to work on a new... Um, and not an intro, like the visual intro, but like when I'm greeting you guys, a new intro greeting, I'm working on that. Now I was working on that yesterday. I need to tweak it a little bit and it'll be done. You know what I'm saying? By the time I get ready to record my next content video, it'll be ready. By the time I get, probably by the end of this vlog, it'll be ready. Seriously. But I'm not going to say it in this vlog because this vlog has already started. So yes, like I said, I said all of that to say because I am the Evelyn Chanel, because this is the the Evelyn Chanel YouTube channel, this is the platform to record and post videos, you guys get a special look into uh the Evelyn Chanel's life. All things all things the Evelyn Chanel. As you can see, I have a playlist. Click check out the playlist. You should be able to do that while you see him watching now with this on the phone, tablet, computer, don't matter. Go check out the playlist now. You will see that there are a list of things that you can take part in and watch. I have a playlist over there. Why? Because I have multiple hats. That's in my intro. I tell you guys that. And that playlist that you see now will continue to grow. It will be things that you may or may not be interested in. But I suggest you guys take it out. I hope you guys are ready for this ride. Like I said, I've said this before and I've had this energy before. But I thank God that um, I am putting him first in my life. And I'm allowing him to do what he needs to do. Why? Because it becomes easier then. It becomes better to encourage yourself then. Period. Point blank. And like I said, being that my follower count is lower now, is really, really the videos that I'm posting are to document for myself and anyone else who 
who's excited for this journey that I'm about to go on. Child, like, I have stuff for y'all. Like, I have really high moments coming and I have really, really low moments coming. I'm pretty sure y'all have been seeing my scenery and my surrounding recently and I haven't really said anything, but I have something coming to explain all of that. Period. The past, like, all of my weekly vlogs so far have been really pivotal moments. I don't know if you guys can see that through the camera. Last week, I think it's week three, was a very, well, no, it was week two. Like, I just why I said all of it have, all these past four weeks have been very pivotal moments. And you guys may be able to see, like, the, uh, what you call it, the dynamic shift a little bit. Um, because... The evolution is going places, and like I said, it's it's specifically very much by the grace of God, and I am so thankful. Um, I said I'm saying that to say, hold on, I'm saying that to say. You've seen some stuff that is going around, and I haven't really said anything. I just been documenting and going with the flow, but these are pivotal moments, and I'm about to get to. I'm about to be able to release. Not because I want to believe, release, but because God is telling me to release. Because honestly, had it been for me, I probably would have held out on it a little bit. But God is going to allow me to release, telling you and explaining to you guys behind the scenes what has been going on through this very pivotal moment for me. Um, and what it has taken to get to where I am. So, like I said, the very, well, not, I don't want to say the very next, one of the next couple of series is that are going, is going to come out is going to be a very, very, very vulnerable series for me. But because I believe in sharing my opportunity, not my opportunity, but my, well, opportunities too, but sharing my experiences and my life lessons, um, because, People go through things, and it is good to share those things, those very raw moments. I am going to trust God, and I am going to share that with you guys in hopes that it encourages and helps someone else along the way. But trust, believe me when I say, uh, the Evelyn Chanel is doing some things, and some things I am doing, which is why I need to get organized now. Um, so that it becomes easier when other things are added to the plate. Child, and just know your girl has been brainstorming and it's about to become the time to where brainstorming turns into writing these ideas down, writing these ideas down, turn into actual manifestations, not because of my glory or because of things that I want to do, but because God gets all the glory for it because God has allowed me. He's allowing me to go forth with the things that he has blessed me um, with, these ideas. And I am very grateful and I am very excited to share that with you guys. And I am sorry for the rant. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. One more thing is there's going to be a lot. Well, I'm not even going to say a lot less talking, but there's going to be some talking, but there is going to be some actual doing as well. So I know I know I get on here and I always talk about how I talk so much and I'll be doing it then or whatever like that. But soon and very soon, you guys are going to see like the behind the scenes little clips that I've been doing so far. That's just a little bit like behind the scene clips before the actual videos and stuff coming out. You guys can look forward to. There are still things that I honestly feel like by the time I get ready to release those videos, the weekly vlogs will not have come out yet. And I am excited about that because I like giving you guys the behind the scene footage before I give you guys a production. And I know I'm recording off a little camera and it may not seem like much to y'all, but being able to put these clips together and making it look the way it looks and giving it the quality that I can from an iPhone, what is this, iPhone, uh, iPhone um, 8? Baby, I am I am proud of me. I, anybody else got to tell me they're proud of me. I'm proud of me, and I, I, I know that God is proud of me for just the creative part of that itself. Um, so, yeah, I'm excited about what's coming. I am um, really energetic. I am really anxious to go ahead and get those things flowing, but... You have to remind yourself, and this is just a little tip for you guys. You have to remind yourself that things are coming. 
And yes, you may get a little anxious and a little excited to get those things out of there, but you have to remain calm because if you get too excited, if you get too anxious, you won't be able to complete the task the way God wants you to p- complete the task. So remain humble, calm yourself down, take a deep breath, and ground yourself because you can't get things done if you jittery and anxious and excited. And it's okay to be excited. But you don't want to be bursting with so much energy that you can't get things done. You know what I'm saying? You, you, you got to calm down. You got to calm down. You got to woosa. Period. So I'm woosa. And I'm ready to share this journey with you guys. Like I said, this should be this should be the last weekly vlog. And honestly, I could probably start recording back. Um, landscape on my phone now, but I want to make sure that I go ahead and edit the next. All I what my goal is to edit all of the weekly vlogs that I have now. Go ahead and post them because when you put stuff on Premiere, it privates the video, so usually your subscribers can't see the video until it's close to time. And once I do my weekly vlogs, then I'll do the other content videos and post them and so on. As you can see, it's really, really bright outside today. It's out potted on my seeds and stuff. Y'all find it a little bit. Um, you don't have to bury it very deep from the research that I did do. I'm about to get ready to download one of those plant apps because I'm planning on planting some other stuff very soon. So as I pick other stuff, it's going to add it on. But you don't have to put them in there deep. Which is why you saw me calling like that. So I'm about to do that. And then I'm gonna water them. I try to stick them in there with like the actual seed. For the so like this right here. This right here. But like the seed part is still attached. I be trying to put it sticking up because that's the part that looks like it's about to bloom. It's not really the seeds, it's what else on the inside. Now the other part, of course, is the beginning of the leaves. And 
like, I like Chanel, you put a whole bunch of more. But if we're being realistic, all of them are not going to bloom. And so it's okay that I put a lot of them in there. But of course, as they start to grow, uh, I'll gradually separate them, put them in bigger pots so that they have more space to stay. I really could have put more dirt up in there, and I might just be powder. Yeah, so this is not how going how it's supposed to go. Um, like y'all know, I had to take my uh perm rise out the other day because I was supposed to take my grandma's appointment, but when I got it, everything was running late. So we're trying to get tomorrow, but I need to grease my edges. Um, I don't understand why I keep saying, um, oh, Jesus, help me. But yeah, so we're just gonna grease these edges, right. And the curls are actually, they don't look very much crushed. Like, they kind of look crushed, but they kind of don't. Like, it's giving very much when I put it together and fluff it out a little bit. It should be fine. But them edges, I was a little concerned about. So, I went ahead and wrapped them back up. And we're just going to grease that right on up. Like, these in the front, they okay because they a little bit longer. Like, they a little bit more full in the middle. But the ones on the side, they, they can't stand up on their own. Like that. So that's why we grease them because we're trying to grow them in like strong bones. I'm going to take my scarf and put it right back on my head. But yeah, like I was saying, it once was going how I was supposed to go. I ended up putting my power rice on my head. Yeah, another deal. But this was supposed to be you follow me all the week and whatnot. So we're just going to see how long it lasts once I do pull them down. Okay, let me turn this off. But good morning, y'all. Um. It's Thursday and we're trying this again. But first we're gonna give a little little fluff a little oil. So yeah, I'm up. Y'all when I woke up the morning just that one ain't it's just giving very much epic fail, but we're about to see what's really going on.
Be early, y'all. Be be there. Be at the doctor's office at nine o'clock. Be at the doctor's office at nine fifteen. But child, the only time I be super early is when I don't know where I'm going for real. Like I don't know the vicinity or nothing. Other than that, baby, I will press for time. Why? Because <laughs> I know how long it's gonna take me to get there, and I know I'm gonna make it on the dot. Don't be like me though. Sometimes I still be late. Um. Uh, I'm either on the dot or late. And what they be saying, if you early, you on time. If you late, if you uh, on time, you late. What y'all? If you're on time, you late. If you late, you late. Because I be late. I be late, baby. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I'm going to my, I'm gonna try to do better, though. I'm going to try to do my best. I'm going to try to start doing better, though. Baby, get your tail about the edge of the road. Sweetie. Get your tail about the edge of the road. Um, I'm trying to, I need to start spending money, but I really be thinking about going to get coffee. I need to start cleaning up my car. Let me tell y'all. So y'all, I'm the, I'm the female. Let me tell you something. You should be this female. You should be prepared at all times. I used to have everything down to a science, baby. I used to have all my stuff ready. I used to have, um, extra little change in the car. I used to have extra pads in the car, extra underwear, extra socks in the car, a blanket in my back seat. Y'all, I just was prepared, and now I could have went. And now I just be out here, but now I just be out here, I just be out here any kind of way. And I don't like that. Like, Chanel, I just, Chanel needs to get her life together. But I need to clean out my car anyway. Hopefully it's today. If not today, I'm going to have to wake up earlier in the morning and do it tomorrow because I have to uh, go back to Oxford tomorrow. So, with that being said, I was going to say, what y'all you, you took out my account again? That's why I'm going to lock my car right back up because no man. Um, so, with that being said, I'm going to do what I got to do. I'm going to do what I got to do. I'm probably going to start on it today, like picking up the little stuff. But I really want to do like a little deep a deep little cleansing um, because I need it. I need it. Like, I'm so serious. Like, my little car, she just be out here looking any kind of way. I need to pick up the trash because people just be throwing in and everything. I'm going back to see. Like, even before I had my nieces and nephews, one thing I learned, and this is why I don't like nobody in my car, because one thing I learned is the grown folks be messier than the kids. Like, Child, I used to have this one so-called friend, baby. And this was when I had my old car. I used to have this one little so-called friend, baby. And she would get out the car and it would be all kind of trash and stuff in my passenger seat. And I never did her like that. I would pick up my trash. Like, when I say, like, trash, like, empty chip bags, water bottles. like, And y'all got a whole truck. My room a little, I mean, not my room. My car a little mess. But y'all see, see that whole trash bag right there? I keep a trash bag in my car. I keep a trash bag in my car. I need to refill them up now. I keep a trash bag in my car, though. Why? Because you need to have the trash. I want the little thing that's like a little miniature um a trash can. But, child, I... Come on here. I want to have the little miniature trash can little thing, but I couldn't find one that would fit like the... the Cause it's supposed to go like around the armrest. Is that what the child? It won't go. I couldn't find one that would fit around mine in my car, so I couldn't get one for my car. So, yeah. But you gotta do what you gotta do, because I, you know, you can't just sit in a regular trash can back there. Why? Cause it's gonna fall over and stuff. It's gonna be. Uh -uh. But this one, it like strap. Like I said, it straps to 
an armrest. Um, so I had to keep looking for one that find that fit my car. I need to like get a new uh, steering wheel cover anyway, and I want to change it because like right now my stuff is pink. I want to change it to light blue, and I need to get some tint on my car too. But I'm trying to get a little bit of extra money before I just do that. But yeah. Trying to get my life together. I said I was gonna stay right here. I'm, like, I'm trying to get my life together. Y'all, I, I be burning these little three minutes up, baby. I be burning them up. This don't make no sense. I talk so much. I'm sorry, y'all. I am so sorry. But I'm so serious. Like, today, I'm gonna put that on the agenda. Anyway, I don't ramble enough. I need to go. Her to where she's going, and what I tell y'all, I'll be here by 9 15. Period. So, yeah, anyway, bye, y'all. This is how. So you take it for well, take it into four sections according to Sierra Raw. That's where I got it from. Thank you. Shout out to her because we give credit where credit is due. And I'm still interested. I'm poor. I'm going to take. I'm going to take. I'm going to take. I'm going to take. I'm going to I cover we'll come back here and put a cover in the laundry mat because the laundry mat is not going to go to my mom's house. Come back here, probably clean up my car so that way I can hit it straight from here on top of the road by the highway. I'm tired. Can y'all hit me? I hope so because I'm not beating it, but I'm finna. Brush my teeth, wash my face, get in the shower, probably go pack up my stuff. And then I'll go get her. Put her cover in the uh, washing machine. Come back, clean my car, pack it, all that good stuff. Um, go run and put it in her um, coffee in the dryer. So we can get on the road. I need to be on the road by 12 o'clock. I think that's more than enough time. Hopefully. But y'all know how I am. So we finna see. It's the next one. But anyway, y'all, so I'm just not about to leave. Like always. Um, but it's okay, I got a little gas in my tank. It's gonna get me the punter top and then I'm gonna get the little cheese.
cheap gas for the for the low low. Girl, why is my bunny like this? This is supposed to be across the front of my head. Anyway, hey y'all. I can't say good morning because it's not morning. But hey y'all. Uh, what? Child, God is good. God is really good.